All right, today we're gonna to make this spiral blend text effect in Illustrator, which isn't done with blend, by the way. So I'm gonna show you how to do it. Step one, select the type tool, type in whatever you want. I'm gonna go with a Creato display font. Let's align it to the center, press and hold shift plus alt, scale it up. I'm gonna click on the stroke, add the black color, and I'm gonna click on the fill. So it's gonna be on the top. This way we're gonna switch up the colors. I'm gonna go with this as default. And let's go to the stroke options and decrease the stroke. I'm gonna go down to 0 0.25. Maybe it's too thin, but anyways, I'm gonna click on it, right click, create outline. Now I'm gonna select it. Let's go to effects, distort and transform, and let's select transform. And we're gonna increase the number of the copies. I'm gonna go with somewhere around 30. And I'm gonna decrease the horizontal. And look at that. I'm gonna go with uh, 97. And vertical also decrease it to 97. You also can decrease it even more, maybe. But it's, it is going to bend it. I'm gonna go and test it out with 92. And all you need to do is go to the angle and spin it just like that. I'm gonna go back to 97, yeah. And I'm gonna spin it like this. And I'm gonna add some more copies. So it's gonna go like this. Look at that. I'm gonna go angle minus two. There you go. So this would be it. Let's click OK. And I'm gonna select it, go to object, expand appearance, right click on group. And I wanna separate the top one so I can recolor only the top one. Now you cannot blend the colors here like with blend tool. For example, I select a rectangle and Create another one, change the colors, select both, go to object, blend, make, double click on the blend, specify steps. If you decrease the colors, you can see there's a blend between the colors and it looks beautiful. Now you cannot do this with the distort and transform, unfortunately, but we still can select all of it. Press and hold shift and deselect the top one. Now right click, group. So this way you basically grouped all of them, expect the top one and you can recolor it however you like. This is pretty nice. And I'm gonna add the background. And there you go. This is how you make this really cool spiral text effect here in Illustrator. Thanks for watching.